Hello, my name is Megan Conway and I'm an assistant professor at the University of Hawaii at Manoa. Today I'm going to talk about a couple of pieces of assistive technology that helped me in the workplace and also helped me when I was a student. The first technology that I want to talk about is an FM assistive listening device. The FM system, as it is often called, is designed for students with hearing impairments and learning disabilities to help them hear better and focus better in the classroom. The FM system is exactly that, a radio that operates on FM waves. It consists of several components. The first is a microphone transmitter, like the one that I'm holding up here. This has the microphone and the transmitter in one. Sometimes you'll also have a microphone that's separate from the transmitter. It looks uh, something like what I'm wearing in order to speak to you today. The next component is a receiver, and I have one that's attached to my hearing aids. Sometimes a user will also have a receiver that has a box that they wear on their body and with headphones, you might see that as well. So there's all different shapes and sizes that the FM comes in. So how does the FM work? A primary problem for people with hearing impairments and learning disabilities is that the farther away a person gets, the harder it is to hear them or focus on them. So in the classroom where you might have a lecturer that's extremely far away, it gets difficult for the person to hear or to focus. Another problem is noise. Any kind of noise can be distracting or for a person with a hearing impairment just makes it more and more difficult for them to hear. So what the FM does is it cuts down on the noise electronically. And it also means that because the speaker is talking into the transmitter and it's close to their mouth, they can be far away, sometimes up to 30 feet, and the person with the receiver can hear them as if they were speaking just six, six inches from their ear. So how can the instructor facilitate use of the FM system? The first thing that you can do is talk to the student. The student knows best how to use their system and under what circumstances. So make sure you talk clearly to them about how you can help with the FM system. Second, always wear the FM system when you're talking to the student, whether you're in a discussion with the student or in the classroom. Don't say, oh, I have a very loud voice, or I'm a good communicator. If the student didn't need you to use the FM system, they wouldn't have asked you to use it. Third, pass around the FM system when you're in a group. If other students have questions, or if you're in a discussion mode, it's important for the student with the hearing impairment who's using the, the FM to be able to hear everyone in the classroom. Don't say, oh, what I have to say is not important, because if it wasn't important, you shouldn't be saying it at all. And fourth, don't draw negative attention to the student using the FM by saying things like, oh, I feel like a reporter, or Bob, can you hear me? Come in, come in. That just embarrasses the student. 